fun that was. Anyway. So in case you didn't notice, the Wrangler is back on the road. Or, kind of. She is making some weird noises in some weird places and I really don't know why. Um, I could just be paranoid so it's hard to tell if it's normal or not, but I really don't think it is. I'm hoping it's just something loose that I haven't figured out yet. It kind of sounds like, almost like a binding. And it's possible it's actually the transfer case. Either way, it's not really a good sign. Um, but I'm hoping it's nothing serious and I just haven't figured it out yet. But that's not why I'm making this video right now. I'm so close to finishing the Wrangler and it's really been kind of postponing everything at the moment. Um, a lot of stuff has happened with this whole virus ordeal or whatever. So I got laid off my job about two weeks ago. No, it's only been a week actually. So actually about a week ago I got laid off my job and that of course has really affected funding for this project and just getting everything going. But on the flip side, with all the free time I've had, I was able to knock out the last few things that I needed and that's really helped with the progression of getting the Jeep actually ready for this whole thing. Right now, the only thing I think I need to do is actually just make sure everything is secure and then I need to get a hard top and bolt in the last couple of things. The AC still isn't put back together so the dash still needs tucked in and everything. Other than that, I'm very close to having the whole thing finished. But until then, I'm going to be ending the vlog for now. Not permanently, but just until I get everything figured out. It was really helpful having the XJ and being able to kind of dabble with what I want to do potentially with it and just try out the lifestyle that I want to do but I wasn't able to really commit to it and it made it really difficult to try to work on the Wrangler and then also make interesting content in the uh, XJ and then at the same time I was um, doing my actual job and trying to balance out all those things and with right now being in quarantine or whatever, being trapped at home with nothing to do, I don't have a job to go to and the only thing I can really do that would be interesting is work on the Wrangler and when I'm doing that I'm not able to focus as much on it and so I really don't have any motivation to give content and I don't even know like all I'm really doing right now is sleeping and working on the Jeep and then I, I then again I am playing a lot of Halo. But it's really hard for me to commit to the channel while I'm just trying to get the Jeep working and I want to be able to actually finish the Wrangler so I can do what it is I want to do and actually come back and make these videos I want to make. And right now I have this opportunity to actually commit to one thing full time because I don't have a job to worry about and nothing's really happening. And, I mean, she's very close to being back on the road and stuff. But, yeah, I've just been sitting here thinking that I don't know what I'm supposed to vlog about because my whole plan with this vlog is to record myself traveling. And I've been, right, right now, all I'm doing is recording myself working up to that point and showing what talking about what I want to do and trying to do as much as I can here to kind of reflect what I want to do in the future and it's worked so far but now like everything's closed I can't go to coffee shops I can't meet new people I can't go anywhere or do anything and I'm very stuck and the whole reason I want to travel is because I don't like the feeling of feeling like I'm stuck in a place and I don't have the freedom to move and when I want to make a channel all about moving and being spontaneous and traveling and right now you know stores are closed co coffee shops are closed and I can can't even just go explore for whatever reason it's really hard for me to find that motivation and enthusiasm to want to create the content so I don't want to just disappear and then 
suddenly come back and be like, here I am. I wanted to, so I'd, I want to make this last video just to kind of talk about why, if I don't make content, why I haven't been making content instead of just completely disappearing. It doesn't mean I won't be updating. I'll probably post on Instagram and stuff about the progress of, and if you ha don't follow me on Instagram, you can follow me in the link below. So I'm going to put the time I have right now and dedicate that to getting ready so when I finally come back, I can actually start the travel vlog. And that's what I'm hoping to do or hoping to accomplish by the time I get out of this is that everything will be ready but by the time this whole thing blows over, I'll actually be ready to do what I've been talking about doing since the beginning of this YouTube channel. And so that's what I'm hoping to do. And I, yeah, I guess there's nothing else to talk about. I really hope that the noise I'm hearing isn't anything too bad. If it is, this whole thing might just be talk and I might not get anywhere, which would really stink. But anyway, that's all I wanted to talk about. And so I hope you guys understand, but I'm going to try to update as soon as possible. It's just waiting for this whole virus thing to get figured out so I can actually get back to what it is I was doing in the first place. But for now, I'll just be gone for a while. I'm going to try to fix some things and stuff. But yeah, that's all. Anyway, to end this video, I just wanted to point out, if you haven't heard already, I started my own little company and I'm actually wearing that shirt again, Nature Shots. And this is actually, this was more of a demo. I did make a better platform right now, but you can buy coffee mugs, stickers, and just these t-shirts. I make a bunch of different shirts. All of them are, look exactly like this, but each one has a, its own unique uh, picture. And I take each, each, I take each of the photos on my own and edit them and post them on a t-shirt or a coffee mug. And you can actually go buy some of those. I have a link in the description below. It really helps me out. Each shirt and coffee mug or sticker you buy actually helps support me to potentially move on to this you know, journey I wanna do. And the idea is that once I get out and I actually get to explore nature, I'll be able to get more pictures like this and I'll be able to make more t-shirts and more content for you guys. And it really helps me if you purchase one of these. And if you don't want to purchase anything, you just want to support me, I have a Patreon down below. But anyway, I'm really hoping that I can finish this and hopefully by the time we talk again, I will be ready to start this journey. So we'll see how that goes. And yeah, see you guys soon. Have a good day. Hope everyone's safe. Oh.